everybody, this is Josh, and this is a video where I trick you into listening to my music by saying, listen to this guitar, but it's a pretty good showcase for this guitar. This is my 1953 Frankenstein Gibson J45. So body 1953, neck used to be who knows what year because the headstock was broken long before I ever got to it and it was replaced with another period correct headstock, or I'm sorry, the neck. Um, now that neck has been broken, not beyond repair, but beyond worth repair. So a new neck was built. Original fingerboard is still here. Uh, headstock cover is still here. And it's a beautiful guitar. So what's the big deal with these old guitars? I'm going to show you. We're going to put it in a song context so you can actually know because we always have these guitar videos with pristine sound, which you've noticed I don't have and you know super isolated tracks and the fact is that's not how music is ever heard in real life ever these strings are ancient and that's one of the beautiful things i'm not going to say it sounds better uh but it still sounds great in a different way with really old strings on it which tends not to be the case with newer guitars uh, this is a song of mine called desperate paperweight and i'm doing it in a different way than i have in the past let's hear the guitar shall we Promise like a broken record. Just when you get in the groove, there's a slot. Oh, yeah, crack shot right through the middle of you. Rings of gold carry on untethered. The time rattles on its rusted spokes, but even wheels are in on the joke. enough of the song. See, that gives the idea of how it feels in a context. It's a big, chewy thing. This is like a molasses candy on the guitar. And I'll show you that with some single notes here, too. By the way, this dead note is not the guitar's fault. That was a product of the new neck, and I gotta get that worked out. But let's be real, nobody's got no business being up here on a on an acoustic guitar. But I did want you to hear how it sings. So another one of mine as a demonstration, great for some ringing flat picking type stuff. This is a song of mine called uh, Leave Me Be.
with some bluesy stuff, so let's let's try that. Gibson acoustic, you're even allowed to bend notes. That's a rule. You're also allowed to want to guild. Martin guitar is not allowed. To recording situations, not ideal setup situation, not ideal string situation. And you know what? I like that uh, because I got to get what I got to get out even if I don't have the patience, gear, or discipline to get it out in the most polished way. And I also like it because life isn't polished. You know, it's just life is not a polished thing. So there you go. That is my Franken 45. That's what I'm gonna call it from now on. Franken 45. Um, it is what it is, and uh, thank you so much for listening. If you enjoyed any of the stuff I was doing music-wise, uh, subscribe here, obviously, that way you can hear more of it, but just particularly pay attention for the next little while and be releasing songs uh, here, recordings, not necessarily brand new songs, but songs that I haven't put out in a, in a formal way, and I'm doing it here in live versions before I get them out in um, more formal versions, a la, you know, streaming platforms and whatnot. So, uh, enjoy. Thank you so much for watching and let me know if I can do anything for you musically or otherwise. Thank you.